A newly discovered comet is making its way through our cosmic neighborhood for the first time in over 400 years. It is named after Hideo Nishimura, an amateur astronomer who discovered it as part of 30-second exposures with a standard digital camera. Comet Nishimura is also called C2023 P1. Ever since it was discovered, the comet has been increasing in brightness. Astronomers have also determined its path across the inner solar system. Comet Nishimura will be at its closest to Earth on September 12, 2023, according to NASA. Since Comet Nishimura has entered Earth's orbit around the Sun, the comet is now a naked eye object. On September 17, the comet will be at its closest to the Sun. Stargazers across the Northern Hemisphere are encouraged to catch a glimpse of this rare event as soon as possible, as it will be another 400 years before the comet returns. Nishimura, comet is green in color and about a half mile in size, will reach its closest point to Earth today before racing around the Sun and back out into space. Weather permitting, you should soon be able to see the comet before dawn, but don't wait. Nishimura is moving at 240,000 miles per hour, and it won't be back for more than 400 years. C2023 P1 Nishimura will come within 78 million miles of us Tuesday that is today. Its orbit has been mapped and it isn't considered a threat. Skywatchers have been photographing the comet on its approach, coming up with some stunning images. Nishimura will appear as the sky gets lighter, but the comet is also growing brighter as it approaches Earth. It's best seen with binoculars or a small telescope. The comet will likely vanish from Northern Hemisphere view after Wednesday. During Comet Nishimura's last visit to the inner solar system, it expelled ice and dust, and these are believed to have created the Sigma Hybrids meteor shower which peaks every year in December. If this is true, the Sigma Hybrids meteor shower is likely to become more active and refreshed with new comet debris. In the second half of September, Comet Nishimura will not only get close to the Sun, but will also enter the orbit of Mercury. This may cause Nishimura's nucleus to break up. At the time of writing, Comet Nishimura is a part of the Leo constellation. According to Star Walk, an astronomical application for stargazing, Nishimura has reached a magnitude of 4.0. Nishimura's astronomical name is C2023 P1, because C indicates the fact that it is a non-periodic comet, which means that it originates from the Oort cloud and passes through the solar system only once, or takes 200 to thousands of years to orbit the Sun. This kilometer-sized celestial body will pass Earth safely on September 12, at a distance of over 80 million kilometers. Like, subscribe our channel Space Bites to never miss our updates on space exploration.